2014 and uh, let us see what's going on uh, say live now click live now and Tomorrow morning at 9.30, the Dadanagar Hall Darshan will happen. So this is the last session of the Parayan for us on Ustream for this particular session. We were reading the paragraph just before business shines if it is with normality. Business shines if it is with normality. I have never heard what you have just talked about before yesterday. The other she says, naturally you would not have heard. All this talk is unprecedented. It has never been heard 
of or been read before. It is completely new. Then only we can have a solution, otherwise how can one get the solution? And if you put a lot of hard work in the business, you look at everything from all sides and still get nowhere, then know that the circumstances are not in your favor. Now in such circumstances, if you were to push yourself a little harder, you will incur even a greater loss. Instead, do something for yourself as capital. Atma, all these problems are you're facing now are because you had neglected to do so in the past life. It is a different matter for those who have attained this gnan. But even people who do not have this gnan, they entrust everything to God, do they not? Do they not say whatever God does is correct? And you will never find the answer if you try to look through your intellect. That's where, that's completing this subsection. The next heading is, Business shines if it is with normality. Profit and loss cannot be controlled, so act in line with natural adjustments. What happens when you have a loss of 500,000 after having earned a million? Money is not able to bear even the loss of 100,000. And there we have now our Gnani walking in up to uh, Lord Simandar. Namo Arihantanam. My highest namaskars to you, my Lord in the live presence of Absolute Self Dada Bhagwan within me. Please accept my our namaskars. I am as pure as you are, my Lord. And uh, to Gnani At Purush Krishna Bhagwan, my Lord, my highest namaskars to you. And to Lord Shiva, for the ones who represent salvation to all the Gnanis of this universe, are my highest namaskars, Om Namah Shivai. And to our Gnani Purush Dada Shri, they are the namaskars that are associated with love that is beyond words. O oh, Dada Bhagwan, with the Absolute Self within me as my witness, please accept my Namaskars. And moving over now to Ma Padmavati. Hey Ma, this Parayan has gone so magnificently. I know it is your grace only. And for this we are all very deeply grateful. And Hey Niruma, our, it is your compilation and your exactness in giving to the world as it is. This Dada Vani and these words of Dada are being revived in those who are on the path of moksha. And then Ma Amba, Hey Ma, make me egoless Sahaj.
as he turns and looks at all of us tomorrow will be the darshan day this time we giving darshan to these thousands who have gathered here and in the dada nagar hall in the in the gigantic hall below the temple as we do the darshan of the mahatmas I take away your sound. we expect part of this session in the morning the, the morning session or maybe the afternoon session where people mahatmas will be doing live open pratikramans to each other and doing deep alochanas coming out with everything in the open in front of the gnani this is the final day as the gnani does his vidhi hello jai sachidanand the awareness of the eternal is bliss i bow to the paramatma the absolute self who resides within you all with a deep sense of oneness and continued namaskar did everybody do the samaik Now today is the Samotsari day, the final day. And the other Shri says, and the Lord says, shoot and sight. At whatever mistake happens, do the shoot and sight. And if you can't do it, then you have to do Raishi Devsi morning. The ones have to be cleared in the evening, and the evening ones have to be cleared in the morning. And if you can't do it, then wash off your mistakes every fifteen days. This is what the Lord had said, and and then you can do it. Uh, Three months or four months, and then at least you can do it once a year. Samotsari pratikraman means pratikraman once a year. This is the traditional way in which pra- parishan pratikraman are going to do. That you know that I have heard other human beings and giants do this all the time. So today is the day of the samotsari pat- pratikraman and the annual day of pratikraman, where you know this entire life any kind of abhav dvesh. Vishay Kashay, you see, we are done with any runa no band, any one with whom we have, we have an account from a past life, and we so that we can finish this runa no band accounts. This is unsettled accounts from past life, so that we can then move on from the birth chitra to Mahavidya chitra. Now let us read a little bit, and then we will take questions, and then we will do the samai kissing. Hmm. This is the <clears throat> this is the morning session of August thirtieth. Uh, oh, that <laughs> so this evening session of August thirtieth, twenty ninth. If <clears throat> in you know if you gamble away your things, no matter how hard you may have worked. and 
You see, this is, we've just read this paragraph. If we put in a lot of hard work in the business, you see, all of a sudden your business was doing good, but all of a sudden you gamble it, put it all in one basket, you do a serious play with the source, uh, show a stock market or whatever you do, and as a result what happens is that you lose it all, and then what you do is, okay, I will go to my friend and get some money and start all over again. Uh, we just lost the... Uh, <clears throat> And then, but you see, but what happens is that, you see, he will, uh, so, you see, so, so, the, the thing is that, you know, like, you know, when you go to buy the, get the money, the loan, the money, the person will say, uh, you know, that he notices that, you know, he does not, have, the time is not very good, so he will go to the end of the village and says, go get some goats from the end of the village. And he says, then, uh, you know, six months later, he says, how many died? He had three... Uh, little baby goats, but you know, they all died. So he realized that no. And then he says, now six months later, he says, how many, uh, there were six were there. And two years later, he says, eight were, eight were born. But on the third year, he says, now there is one uh, baby lamb, baby goat living. And then he says, the following year, he says, now this year, all the eight are living. So he said, now how many, how much money do you want? He says, you are asking for me every time, you know, that he says, if your, if your, if your, if your baby goats are dying every year, what should I give you? Because, you know, so now you, whatever you want, now I can give you. Now your life has turned. Now the sun is rising as with reference to your fortunes. So now whatever you ask more, I will give, loan you the money. So Dadashri says, he says, when Dadashri is therefore explaining that when you are having bad times, Nothing is happening at that time. Shrink and you see and sit and just do the satsang activities and then when the good times are rolling, then do whatever you want to do. <coughs> and I say, all these problems you are facing now are because you had neglected to do so in the past life. It is a different matter for those who have attained this gnan, but even people who do not have this gnan, they entrust everything to God. Do they not, do they not say... Whatever <coughs> God does is correct and you will never find the answer if you try to look through your intellect. Next heading, business shines if it is with normality. Profit and loss can be controlled. So act in line with neutral adjustments, na natural adjustments. Whatever happens, what happens when if you have a loss of 500,000 after having earned a million, one is not able to bear even a loss of 100,000 and the whole day he will be crying and worrying, hey, he even will grow crazy. <laughs> he says, you see, the, the, you see, if it's the one who, the one who has greed problem, he is expecting a profit and if he gets a little bit of loss, he takes a serious beating. And, uh, and if the one who is expecting a lot of respect, if he does not get called even, then he will get a lot of suffering. So, so it is, you know, the 500,000 is... Yes, because he does not have the energy to even sustain a loss of 100,000. In the same way, you are expecting a lot of respect and you don't get any, then you will be very dejected. And so, and so many people have lost their minds in this way. Does one have a, you know, Mahatmas also get mentally depressed when their ego is kicked of pride. It is not, uh, their, it is not nurtured. Does one have to work at, hard at night or at 2, 3 in the morning? The man is sure to become crazy, Dada. They are already crazy. How much crazier can they get? The whole world has become like a mental hospital full of crazy people. Has it not so sure so so you should not become crazy again. Can there not be double the madness? So profit and loss is not under your control. Therefore keep working and meet whatever obligations you have to meet. Uh, shouldn't there be at least normal time for work? Yes, there should be, says Dadashri. Questioner, one should keep working for about 8 to 10 hours, but not for 15 to 20 hours. Dada says, there should be a rule like that. Questioner, the working folks do have a rule, but the business people do not seem to have a rule to live by at all. Dadashri says that if a shopkeeper makes a rule like that, then who will tell them no if he wants to keep his shop open till 2 in the morning? Someone may suddenly stop by and pick up two packs of cigarettes on his way from the station. Who says no to him? You fool! Is there an end to such a thing? Um, are you going to stay up all night just to sell two packets of cigarettes? 
it is also pointless if you open your business at 6.30 in the morning when everyone else opens at 8 o'clock. All that effort is wasted. Even to open later than 8 is wrong. Likewise, one should close the business in the afternoon when all others do. Questioner. Many manufacturers run their factories at three shifts and others see this and want to follow suit. The other she says, why, are you try, why not try to operate five shifts? Nature has balanced our bodies by equipping it with two of each, like two ears, two eyes. So if you lose one, you still have the other one functioning. So nature has many such things in twos. Does it not similarly one can run two shifts at the most, but otherwise there is no end to it? Questioner, all these worldly entanglements should be maintained within as much normality as possible. The other, she says, if while eating your chit, the inner component of knowledge and vision does not wander off to your factory, then your factory is worth having. What is the point of owning a business that takes your chit away from the dinner? The business that causes the heart to fail is of no use to us. Therefore, you have to understand normality. What happens to a newly married person who works three shifts and has no time to spend with his wife? And when he goes home, his wife tells him, You don't even spend any time with me. You don't even talk to me. This is not appropriate, is it? So your business should be conducted in a way that is normal for the world. Now, in order to give rise to business related to separation uh, due to difference in opinions with your father, in order not, in order to avoid matabeda, avoid separation due to differences in opinions with your father or anyone at home, then you should say whatever works is fine by me. But all you members of the household should work together like a parliament. They should jointly set a limit as to how much money they are going to amass. You do not want any more money once the goal is reached. Questioner, no one will agree to that, Dada. Dada, she says, then it is of no use. Everyone has to agree all together. It is buffering here. Okay. Okay, still buffering. I've lost uh, the video continuity. <coughs> so I will continue reading because she is reading too. Let's finish this. You may want to run four shifts for your business if you can get an extension of 200 years for your life. That is not possible, is it, Dada? Then you need to take into account all of this. Uh, Let me refresh it and see what happens here. Uh, hopefully, it's still buff buffering. You see, you need to be in normality with reference to your business. The more he is pushing, the more the other Sri is talking about normality. Who, who, who is, who is, who are you? Why, who, who are you going to leave all of this money for? This is, you are so blind in your knot of greed that you just work like an ox. Uh, uh, you just work like an ox, you see. And so today's Lakshmi is the result of merit karma of previous life. And if I keep this, you see, you see, the money doesn't come just because you keep your eye shop open for a long time. Now it works, okay, it works, all right. So it will come. Then then it is, on, everything has to agree. You, might, you want to run four shifts or your business if you can get an extension, 200 years of life. That is not possible. You need to take all on this account. There is merit in continuing to earn only if there will never be a loss. But you are going to lose it, so that liability still remains. Does loss happen or not? Yes. 
But you see, when it when pain when bliss is there, then you know that is forever. But if it it is followed by pleasure, pain, pleasure, pain, then you know it, this is the research of the other. There is no moha, illusory attachment. There is no mamta. There is no iness or minus. To be, uh, I am kachya is moha, and uh, this is happening to me. My this is mine is mamata. Yes, it does. So when you suffer loss, should you sit all sit together and cry? There will be anger, turmoil all day long, and you don't know what where you want to go. Why does one do this? It is as if one has managed to get his lifespan extended for one or two thousand years. They give you an extension over there, don't they? No one will give such an extension that is. So then, what is all this for? Yes, you should engage in business, but it should be balanced between work and family. You should find time to eat and rest for at least. Half an hour before going to work, but what is the point? What is the point of running here and there, and as if you have brought a thousand-year extension to your life? Should you not do something for the self too? There should be your first priority. The fact that you are happy and at peace now is a reflection of you having done something for the self in the previous life. Otherwise, you will have you would have died working hard in this life. This is the fruit of your efforts. To attain the self, so in the, so in this life, do it all over again, to bear fruit in the next life. Adequate adjustment of equipoise, equanimity. Make a deposit in an assumed reserve account. Questioner. There are certain targets which cannot be adhered to, and if we are expecting a five rupee profit, but we incur a loss, then that becomes stuck in the mind. The other, she says, you should immediately credit this loss into the loss account when you do that. That account get cleared. So what happens is that for that one forms a prior opinion that a profit will be realized this way or that way, and that very really is the place one incurs a loss. When such prior expectations prove to be wrong, you should say that this is we have a sit. Thereafter, if it is in your vyavastit to make another loss, you will make another loss, and if it is in your vyavastit to make a profit, then you will make a profit. So, profit and loss are not in your control. Profit will come to you, even if you say no to it, and if it will not work, if you say no more profits, and I am tired of it. Therefore, there will be a pressure of profits, even if you say no to it. Pressure for profit and pressure for loss. Therefore, never dwell in profits or losses. If you expect, if you expect a profit, then if you get a loss of even five thousand, uh, when you uh, then you will suffer. But if you expect a loss, and if you get even five thousand profit, you'll be so happy. You see, therefore, you know, even if have a reasonable expectation of profit and a reasonable expectation of loss, or do not even think about profit or loss at all. And you know, I believed on that I was getting a profit of twenty-five, but all of a sudden you get forty thousand. But if you believe that I will get two hundred thousand, then if you get forty thousand, you will be depressed. So, the this is the other had understood and applied and uh, learnt this kada. Kada is the art of early interaction. It's from the very beginning. The other says. Well, he would say whatever he would do, he would believe that it is going not going to work out, not going to work out, and then if it does work out, he feels that is good. Never have the expectations of profit. You see now. He says five to eight years later, all the uh, account books are cancelled anyway. Are they not so now? So why do you even get into it? If you get a loss of two thousand, you say. You should just take it out from Vyavastit. If there's a loss of two thousand, you know, which your pocket gets cut, take it from the uh, Vyavastit, and then when the twelve hundred and twenty-five rupees or dollars come back, when the thief is caught, just give it to the credit. You see, there is a, an untouched income in the Vyavastit of everyone, and so you see, so you can take it out and put it back in Vyavastit. Uh, regardless of what is happening to your account books in business, but if you get into Arthadhyan and Rudhadhyan, then there is very danger. It's very dangerous for you, for the future. Certain prominent businessmen will assist uh, me. No, you will have to fly to Calcutta. Insist. 
they will insist even when I tell them no, no, nothing will let you off, will it? So do not think about profit or loss. The day you incur a loss, you should deposit 500 rupees into a reserve account as a credit. This way your account will show a credit balance. You see, whenever there is no desire for profit, profit continues to happen. And the same thing is with losses too. If you do not think about profit, profit will arise. So then spend that time in, in the soul only. <coughs> because are the account books ever permanent? Do, not, do we not destroy them after 2 to 8 years? Would anyone destroy them if they were permanent? They are all tools to pacify the mind. When you incur a loss of 150 rupees, deposit 500 rupees against that loss into your reserve account. So then you will see a credit balance and and uh, you will see a credit balance uh, of 350 rupees available to you. So instead of seeing a loss of so instead of seeing a loss of 150, you see a credit balance of 350 rupees. This world is false multiplied by false and thus it is uh, 144. It is not exactly 12 by 12 equals 244. It would be considered an exact principle it were exactly 12 times 12 equals 144. Worldly life means implied by lies. Lies multiplied by lies is equal to 144. And moksha means exact 12 by 12 144. If you are a chartered accountant, if you say you have had a lot of loss, he'll say, no, 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 no. He will look at it, he says, no, 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 no. In fact, you did not count this. Actually, there is a profit for your profit on your... Uh, uh, so, yeah, so, so just keep it in your account of... Okay, so just correcting something that is with the computer while we wait the uh, <clears throat> revising of the it's buffering again. If they, you know, even the accountants who work for the, for the office, they, if they, when they see a loss coming on, they say, well, who is going to suffer the loss? It is the boss who is going to suffer the loss. I am just, I'm, but in the same way, if you say, I am a pure soul, this is, uh, this is happening, the loss is happening to the business. And, and if you have, you have picked a good line, the self and the satsanga where there is no one to bring a profit loss. If there is any loss, it comes to the neighbor only, Chandubai. It is always the neighbor and the shopkeeper or the landlord who may suffer a loss. Not being the, their partner, we do not participate in their good luck or the bad luck. We remain normal all the time. Had you not attained this gnani, you would feel, a, I do not feel successful so far in the world and you would then have to enter the race course with the rest of them. What would happen when you find yourself incapable of running but you, have no, but you have to enter the race. Furthermore, you will have to be concerned about other horses. But you see, now, you know, you don't want to run with the other horses in life, you see. You know, the world is running in the relative, you see. But, you know, get out of the relative and come, come into the real. There is no jealousy, competitiveness, uh, hurt to each other, etc. Even if you try 100 tired ways of trying to become free from it, you will not be able to, you see. So therefore, um, come on, I'm just getting this problem with the buffering situation and uh, but sooner or later, you know, in some, some way or the other, will you not have to go to moksha anyway, so it is very important to kind of go into you, you, no matter how much success you've had in your business, in whatever kind of business, but sooner or later it is going to bound to in a, a bound to get uh, get a loss, and so get out of this competitiveness, you know, and running around unnecessarily, running with the other horses. Do you understand? This world is not exact. It is not twelve times twelve equal to hundred and forty-four. 
Well, you have picked a good line. Had you written this line, you see, what you would happen if you find yourself uh, incapable of running, but you have to enter the race. Furthermore, you see, they are all reading in the race. Yes, why don't you read? Why don't you again now? It is you come to the real. There is no okay. There is a repetition of what we have just done. This I have the Deepak Bhai is repeating himself. I think the 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 restreaming it is happening in there, and there's not a problem with our internet. They are resending this whole thing. <clears throat> you know, if you have had a great, if you have been number one in the year in one year, you will be number seven the next year. So just let go of this. Competitiveness, etc. <clears throat> Don't get trapped into it. Do something that you'll become eternally blissful only. Do you understand? Ah, oh, come on. Again, it's uh, <clears throat> buffering. Uh, excuse me, Shuja will be right back. <clears throat> <clears throat> So the buffering is still going on. Let's see what's happening. Mm. Okay, so the next question is here. Somebody is asking a question already. So they have finished. What is the importance of listening to the Parayan? She is asking. How long have you been coming to Parayan? And have you been here since the first day? Do you do you feel like you have given a gotten any profit? That is the profit. The profit is your importance. You see, for uh, the the uh, the misunderstanding of infinite previous lifetimes is gone, and you get the eternal right understanding. Are you are you doing parayan to uh, to earn merit karma? No, you are doing parayan for moksha. Forget about it. if you have merit karma. Is she a jain? If you do merit karma, then you'll have to come back. No, we don't want punya or merit karma. We just want to become free from the uh, free from this thing. You see, so we want to become free from this. Next one, money is subject to the law of touch. Okay, no. So the questions. I think Q is a session. Jyotika Pancholi. All right. So we stop there. Now that is. Jai Sachidanan. I am from Jacksonville. This is the first one for me in India. I am from Jacksonville, Florida. In these eight days, I have had uh, I have had great uh, benefit. I did not know how to do samayik, but after coming here, I could understand what is samayik, and uh, Uwe is saying giving a message. So let's see what's the message from Uwe. I don't know, but anyway, so. Uh, that he stopped reading and he started. Okay, yes, Uwe, I got that. Okay, right. And so the bliss has increased, and therefore I'm very grateful for Pujya Vadil. Is helping a lot of Mahatmas, Vadil, and so she wants to thank you very much that you have, you have. So and it has made. Another question is that whenever I do samayik, I guys am able to see everything in samayik. But when I'm working in the kitchen, etc., I there is a lot of things. And then I'm able to see the not inside, and I'm able to talk. I can do pratikram samayik. Yes, if yes, is that purusharthu? Yes, that is good. It is all getting washed off only. You can do pratikraman also. The one who wants to go deep, 
you see if the water is still then you see if the water is still then you can see a coin at the bottom of the pond but uh, a shallow pond however so so she says is walking samaik okay yes if it is working for you good but it is not but sitting samaik is much better if you take the time and then you sit down then you'll be able to see and as it if you if you are able to see it as it is while you are doing the work in the kitchen then it's good and please grant me the energy so that this samaik will continue while i'm in america this continue to come to shibits thus i will come that is all next one what the other she, the other says that this is this gnan of the our gnan and niruma says that our gnan is on autopilot but it is at times it feels that it is not on autopilot at at home there is 24 hours application of gnan only only in normal life but but when actual incidents happen that i have to apply gnan at that time gnan does not come in you see then i have to search for gnan but but when there is nothing happening there is total application of gnan at home only no that second stage will come later on initially you have to be in the upyog of gnan the use of gnan when you get a big kick in life then the gnan will be there for you when major pain comes then every about the police catches you etc everything will separate so amazingly you see was you see but so when you really need it the gnan will definitely arise for you in life uh and so do pratikraman so you cannot say that 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 the gnan goes away the gnan is there for you when you really do need it due to in during the times of major adversity in life it will arise in front of you you see on little matters it may not come but uh, that is but when there is a huge loss a huge destruction a huge uh, adversity pain calamity this uh, catastrophe at that time the gnan will present for you in exactness the gnan is exactly on autopilot it is extremely working on its own all the time and uh, and you see uh, the work of infinite lifetimes is being finished in one uh, one lifetime don't you think this is amazingly uh, working on its own otherwise how can the suppose i have say i have two friends one in surat one in delhi if they both of them come here i uh, see then when the both of them come here then i can go and meet them i can go and meet them and then then the one they sometimes they sit with me i am with, the, with them on saturday and then i come back on sunday afternoon you know but when i want to meet them then they say no they will not allow me to come they will not allow me to come and Deepak Bhai said that is correct because if you are the one with entanglements, they might not let you in. Is a well, why is your father does not like that you leave home? Because you see, my friends, my my I go out to see meet my friends when they come every time. You know, my parents do not like that my me myself visiting my parents my my friend when I go. Well, you know so that do i satisfy my friends or do i satisfy my, my parents i don't know no parents are more important than friends always the first circle is the circle of the friends uh, of the of the parents and the wife and the children and you have to take care of them before you start thinking about uh, your friends you see so you can tell your friend oh no you know i can't come and stay with you in your hotel or whatever you know because but you see they don't have such expectations but you are trying to push yourself on them if i their true friends they will understand if they are good friends you can tell them if they are good friends of yours they will, you know you can call them to the parayan one is in delhi but wherever they are don't you think come on if he is your true friend even if he is in delhi i say he will come all the way i had i say i say i had i had 12 friends who used to drink but there was one friend who kept a satsang 
or the eleven friends went away, but one friend remained. One of his friend remained, and he came in such song. So, so, so f- friends of the bottle and friends of such song. You see, there are friends. Friends will be around when you share drinks, but a good friend is the one who will be around whenever you need him. Not even, not just when you are serving wine, etc. So, therefore. Yeah, my parents have the prakruti that they do not. They are all very suspicious of me. They don't let me go out. But and do you think that uh, the with the right understanding, is there any change in the prakruti? No, the changes do not happen in prakruti that was created in the last life. Only the way you approach it changes. You look at it changes. Next one. the there is a, there is infinite energies of the self why is that why is the soul bound by the non matter the non self no this is because the energy is of the self has never been used only the vibhavik shakti i am over i am katya that energy has been used and therefore you see when you use the energy of the self you see he will enter into moksha I know at the center I cannot do the samaiks like that are happening in here. At home I cannot do the samaik at all. I know when I try to do samaik at home I fall asleep. Then the answer is that you have a lot of junk within you. So therefore you have to come to more into satsang shibir. And then once you come to satsang shibir, then you will become still. We want you to do such a way that even as you are walking around, you have samaik only. But you know, right now we have to make the adjustments only. This is because of the junk that is going on within you. You see, but ultimately, by coming to Shibir and Parayans, the Jagruti, the awareness increases and the stillness increases. I, I can, I you know, I do not fight with anyone, but I do fight with file two a lot. The husband, I am constantly fighting with the husband. She says, but even you know, if I go home, I know this he will be affected. Or who do you think whose fault is it? It's your fault only. So grant me the energy. Yes, as you wash it off, you will be able to get out of it. I want one more question. That well, Mahatmas take a lot of time with you for your darshan. So I, I please, you know that that method is correct. You see, there is no. You don't need to do anything. You should write down. You should be aware there are a lot of people behind me. That that awareness is more than enough. Otherwise, people hang around your feet, Deepak Bai, during darshan. Next one, and then next one is Jyotika Pancholi. I, when I did the samayik of Lalach, intense desire for greed, I could see the heavy knot of greed of Jyotika, and I felt like it will take me years before I can finish it. Why do you say that? Why do you apply extra mathematics to it? You are just supposed to see the big knot. That's all. Who knows when it will all melt away? There are fifteen thousand. Oh, there are fifteen thousand people here. When the when will the hall empty? You see, when the time is up, the entire hall will be empty. If you come here at at nine o'clock in the evening, the hall hall all is empty completely. You see, if we have not emptied. Anything in the countless previous, infinite previous lives, and now we are worried about when will it empty? When will it empty? The, you see, if the if the knot is huge, against that the vignan is infinitely la more powerful. You see, against it, I am the one with infinite knowledge and infinite energy. So you really need to kind of focus on it now. But my 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 uh, knot of heavy greed. I also have the <coughs> the greed for money. Also, when there was an accident in the car, I lost a lot, and I also claimed wrong because I made a wrong claim because of this thing. I have donated the money that I didn't. I got on false insurance claims, <coughs> but I can see all of this and uh, this uh, knot of greed. I but I have fear for it. How can I become free from fear? You just already said that you have gave <coughs> you you gave away the money that you had received but through false claims. Claims that means you are the 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 no, that means uh, you are not of greed is is melting. You are on the right track. 
supposing you've gone 20 miles uh, wrong direction if you know the right direction you don't mind that 20 miles that you have gone the wrong way i have and i have heard read in the dada vani that the, the, the credit and the debit karma cannot negate each other you will have to suffer the the effects turn by turn are you jyotika or are you shuddha i am pure soul only no new no karma are binding for you it is the old fill stock that is emptying that is all you just need to settle it and become free that is all no no you will not wander anymore that is all remain in the ch- touch with satsang and five agnas only that is all samant Samant Ramsibai Bareya, a long complicated name. And then Sonal Rajkot, Pramoda Jadav. Kaila, what has she written? I can't read the name. Hemlata Ben Yadav. Meena Mohan Bhai, Bhai. Meena Ben Mohan Bhai. Patel Kanta Ben Pralad Bhai Mesana. Kirit. Kirit Trivedi Rajkot. Jai Sachidandi Pabhai. The begged pain. Warily Delu Dukh. The pain. Invited pain. I used to imagine my own pains. And then I felt as if I left my sense of reverence for you. Because when mother-in-law or father-in-law are coming, the problem is already starting one day before they are coming to my home. And she started crying now. Do you have... Is your mother-in-law here? No. So your mother-in-law is here and already you are crying? <laughs> Do you think the mother-in-law is pushing you from the back? No. Once they are there, then I have... I, my camera is only on file 2 only. And I feel that, you know, when my mother-in-law, father-in-law is that I find that my, my husband ignores me. And so I feel like I want to call my dad and complain about this thing. And no, uh, then I say, if your mom and dad are here, you are so nice to them. So why do you not become well with his mother and father? But but the inside, uh, the one inside does not want to listen. And so the. And so then my my conduct becomes very spoiled. My. And then I hurt my father-in-law and mother-in-law terribly. When this happens, and then inside I don't like it at all, but I see that the conduct is all going on. So therefore in Samaik I can see all my mistakes and it bothered me so much. And then every time the same problem arises, every time I am doing the Pratikrama and then I am crying all the time because of this. I felt as if my heart is going to stop. <laughs> so can you imagine that you are worried that your heart is going to stop completely? <laughs> this is the kind of entanglement a human being puts herself into. You know, the, the parents come for f- three to four days only and you say they will do satsang or shibir. And this is all invited pain only. I have invited the pain. Do you understand? Vori Levanu pain. Invited back when nobody is giving you pain, you are imagining all of these pains and you are begging pains. Please grant me the energy. And my my father-in-law and mother-in-law are very nice. They are very nice. They are very adjustment. My it is my own pains that I have caused. It is my own misunderstanding only. I need to improve my understanding. Are you going to say the same thing in the next uh, shibir also? I want to, somewhere I have left, lost my reverence for my elders, 
forget about it just forget about the puja bhav and the reverence just stop begging for pain stop i don't i want to become free from this rag dvesh i want to settle all files with equanimity with uh, and i want to see everybody's pure soul next one deepak bhai she is not letting go the mic i want to ask for i i want to ask they are here already i will you do it over all over again will you cry again no no the family is here no they are here i want to ask for forgiveness i want to where are they oh, yeah they are right here they're uh, they are sitting here where are they they yeah, you know my my father in law and mother in law are here why don't you go and ask for forgiveness i want to move forward in gnan and agna just go ahead yes 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 i understood yeah, yes you already understood that <laughs> come on move shall i ask for yes go 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 she is going to go to the father in law and the mother in law <laughs> she is going to go to the father in law mother in law and the yeah, satsang will continue kirit trivedi and more are being announced so standing if i but my uh, file 2 has taken gnan but he is serious depression so he cannot come to the satsang he has serious psych- he wanted to come but he cannot come because of his mental illness and so therefore and i am coming to the parent for the first time only and i like it very much i the great samayaks are happening i would want my file 2 to be able to come the blessing so that we, so that we can come together and we grant me the energy hemlata ben yadav okay good and he has a lot of addictions and so i keep on telling him you know i he spends money on his uh, on his addictions and so i don't know what addiction he has but she says that i want to do pratikraman what should i do you should teach him that you know ask for the energies for the dada to become free from it you see you know if there is a he wants money give it to him but don't fight him i do give him money but but oh he has got the addiction of this uh, uh, smoked tobacco chewing you see chewing tobacco so masala tobacco you see spicy tobet tobacco and spiked tobacco this is bad for your health in and might cause this cancer of the mouth and throat you just have to see his pure soul and uh, uh, ask for the energies uh just make him hope that he will uh, move in the right direction next one arti veda word yes then this lady is uh, is gone in front of her father in law and she is flat in front of her father in law he is uh, forgiving her let us see what he does jay sachidanand and the mother in law also and uh, jay sachidanand jay sachidanand and now jay sachidanand now let us see what happens uh, now the gentleman will go in front of and you know give her a microphone and now he has gone half flat not completely flat the what directions are you see he says that it is because of you know that's the husband now the here the husband is here he says i was the reason why she has this good lady you know my parents are here another person is here now wanting his Yes, go and we just go and ask for forgiveness live in front. So that I have abused my authority as a husband, he says. I always wanted to do something good. I wanted to help them, but in the process, I help hurt them. And so, but now I I used to see so much fear in him or her. But I was able to see all that fear in the one that I have suppressed through my authority. you see his son he is talking about his son you see he says that i have put my son in so much fear by by, by abuse of my authority as a father that <clears throat> that i want to ask for his forgiveness now just go ahead ask for the forgiveness and now live in its love from here onwards and uh, there is uh, the uh, the the other side i think uh the, the father of the daughter is also here and she says i have been very heavily wrong with uh, the this woman you see mm-hmm. 
as you see all three daughter in laws are my like daughters only you see i don't have any difference between my daughter and my daughter in law says the gentleman the father in law and here the young man has gone to the father in law the mother in law of his own daughter uh, the gentleman and he says have you her forgiven each other or do you have any kind of junk still lying within you have you cleared it all off have you cleared or it all or not have you forgiven he is asking have you no i don't have anything just just ask for the forgiveness and so do it you behave in such a way that your parents are happy you see you must not hurt your parents at all move your life in such a way that you will not hurt them this is very beautiful scene in front of us um and uh, deepak bhai is observing it in front of the gnani they are doing all of their alochana and pratikraman live and you say sometimes i have hit my daughter also and so you know i have hit my daughter please forgive me deepak bhai <coughs> please forgive me i have all right now next yeah it's such a so the entire family is here there okay next one niraj lal mehtalia kirit trivedi i had done an alochana with niruma and i had a lot of awareness but but you know the fill stock you never know the junk when it come out and so the i don't know how much stock i filled that the stock will continues to comes out even after doing a major alochana with niruma you know you you know now don't you have new power in this shibir also so keep on you know have the keep on ha- turning the handle of awareness and become separate from it keep yourself separate from all of this junk jai sachidanand and then varsha from veravad i want to ask for the forgiveness from file 2 my husband because i have done all kinds of torments to him i have hurt him a lot i have a request please i have a request that please come forward i want to i want to ask for your forgiveness in front of all of these people 15000 people who are gathered here i want to will you do it again no i will not do it again i do not want to see his mistakes and i do not want to take his mistakes i don't want to take the mistakes nor do i want to uh, give any pain to anyone okay good so go ahead do it is the file to there where is file 2 where is his husband husband is here he is how will i find him there he is oh the right there he wants to uh, live the rest of his life in adalaj only but varsha has got so much junk that she has stick uh, attains that she cannot come to adalaj what grant me the energy that i want to become free from it yes yes live with love only ask for the energies to become free from it all right okay and so that's her husband she is flat in front of him and uh, na jagdish shoni baruch let's see what the husband does Yes, go on, go on, clear it out so that you can free from her. Do you want her in the next life? He is gone flat in front of her for all the stuff that he has done to her. Okay, so and he say, if you forgive her, you're done with it. That's all. Next one, and uh, and and treat the children with love. Don't hurt them. The two of you. Remember that. Next one, Rasila Patel from Rajkot. Yes, Sachidan Deepak Bai. This is Arti Veraval. I I want to call my file too in front of you. No, 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 in front of you. No, no, no. Where is he? You need to go to him. Where is he? These are selected people who have been asked to come. <coughs> What is your name, ma'am? Where is your file? <laughs> is he here okay okay yes ask for forgiveness and don't ever do it again i have hurt him through mind speech and body i know also i want to and she's crying and she says i also want to to become uh, to f- ask for forgiveness from everybody in the home too so there she goes only half bending <clears throat> there is uh and joy sachidanand now the gentleman and he goes halfway also now full all the way all right 
Jai Sachidanand and she's smiling. <laughs> okay. All right. Jai Sachidanand. You don't want to say anything, do you? He's asking the gentleman. Okay. <laughs> if she lets it's if she lets go of you, Moksha is there. <laughs> Deepak Bhai is saying. If she lets go of you, you are in Moksha. Everybody agrees. And the problem is with the wife. <laughs> problem is with 2009 I took Nan and I have attended a lot of Shibirs, but this Shibir is exclusively special. That that whatever I've done, that whatever mistakes I've done, I want to, I want to, f I want to open it up completely. In 2011, I did. Do you, when my file two did the alochna at that time, I my ego was so high that I could not come to do the alochna. I told him that you don't need to say anything, and then I was not able to kind of open up my mistakes in 2011 when my wife opened up completely, and then through ignorance. And then I, but in the interim time, I hurt my file 2 and 3 a lot. And many times I have hurt and I openly hurt other people. And you know, I have not listened to my elder brother in the family also. Whenever my older brother tells me something, I have not listened to him. And, but when they had, when he had an accident, and when he asked for money, I did not even give him some money when my older brother who had an accident needed some money. I was so arrogant that I told I did not give him anything. Whenever there are kashais with the wife, I then I will I will hurt her openly, but I will call her parents and say what a nonsense woman she is. So I have done all kinds of things. Is she here? And so he is asking. He is asking uh, two people of his family members to come in front of him. He wants to, his wife, and don't you think you have done something good? She is asking, no, 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 I, I too. And more than him, I feel like I have done much more because I want to have it my own. Okay, so we just, okay, all right. I have lost Houston connection. Okay, Ube, I will done it. Okay. Okay, okay, I'll do it. I'll take care of it over. But so I will do it. Yes, this is the streaming had gone. And so, so he says the fault. She says my fault is my fault only, not her fault. That. But you see, because I want to have it my way only. I I'm willful and I want to have the my own illusions uh, at satisfied and therefore the moment I see my husband I have dvesh I have I'm I have dvesh feeling every time I see him no no so so Deepak Bhai is now telling them you have mistakes also do you not so if he is doing alochana and pratikraman for you uh, then you should also forgive him so so you should so just kind of turn it through love only you know find out what is beneficial and so this then now she's talking about my daughter. My daughter is also a very rebellious mode. You see, you let go of your husband, and now you're attacking your wife only. You see, I I you see the problem. The people says you let go of your husband, but now you're attacking your daughter only. You see, you see, and yes, we all of you just now ask for forgiveness. Do you want to say anything? And the son is now. He's talking. He says, he's my five four. You see, he says she says you know I. You know, she is more attached to the to the son rather than daughter. So all of these kind of reactions are happening of an unsettled account in a previous life. You are meeting each other in this life because these accounts were not settled. Just everybody has different prakruti. So you need to find out how you can be supportive to each other rather than how to be obstructing each other, you see. So do this uh, in a nice manner, you know. So you are so, so, you are so fortunate that all of you are coming in satsang together. So, so this is uh, her son and the father and the daughter and the mother are standing in front of us. So, you know, now you, all of you have come to satsang. So, you have so much love for satsang. So, all your problems will get solved, you see. I do not want to hurt anyone, Deepak Bhai. I just, this is my one. So, in front of everyone, I just, uh, I want to say, please forgive me. Please forgive me. So, so I just ask for the forgiveness now. And so, there they go, each other, quarter bending. 
uh, where they are with their intentions are good and that is a critical thing so this is all happening in front of us and Deepak Bhai is singing the say sing Dada Bhagwan Nasin Jai Jikarho so everybody is singing now Dada Bhagwan Nasin Okay, now you also go ahead and just ask for forgiveness now so that you will not fight with each other anymore. Asim Jai Jai Karho Jai Sachidan. The Gnani is pleased. Let us now take a break now and then we'll return after the break now, okay? Alright, Jai Sachidan. Okay, Shudatma Bhagwan, I will. S- uh. So, we are in a little break session here now. So this is a re- recess. Yeah, yeah. 
I met the gnani because of this out of this world morning that dawn of the morning This is the last session of the Parayan of 2014 Parishan Parayan. Yeah. <coughs> And the break has happened. The open Pratikraman, Alochana Pratikraman will have happen and will continue to happen after the break too. <laughs> The one who can see his own mistakes can become a god that is the first line And having become awakened and aware he does not make those mistakes again the one who is not the owner of the body the one who is not the owner of the speech
where there is no ownership of the mind, then one becomes the Vitarag, one becomes established as the Self. The one who sees his own mistakes can see it, become a god in this world. The one who sees his own mistakes from the past life, that is the right vision. The one who understands that I am trapped because of my own faults, that is the right vision. And the one who sees the faults of others, that is the wrong vision or the mithya drashti, wrong. The one who sees his own mistakes, the world will let go of him, leave him alone. As long as you continue to see the faults of others, there is the living fire within. The fire continues to burn within. Bhul is mistakes. It is worth being compassionate for the people of this world. Be compassionate for the people of this world. Do not hurt them anymore. Do not make life miserable for them. Do not punish them. The one, the fearless Gnani of Dada will never see anyone at fault. As long as you see the world at fault, you'll have to continue to wander around. Wandering is directly related to the seeing the faults of the world. They are all nothing but sacks of karma only. Find out what is the... Find out the Lord within them only. And settle by seeing the gold within them, the Lord within them, settle those files with equanimity and come to a zero. Yeah.
जय सचिदानंद हेलो संदीप लेट अस टेक सम क्वेश्चंस नाउ रसिला पटेल हंसा वसाणी प्रवीण वसाणी राम निवास जय सचिदानंद जय सचिदानंद शी सेइंग आई हैव अ लॉट ऑफ ब्लिस देयर वर लॉट my file too is ignorant what should i do with him will i bind karma no you settle the file with equanimity i try to do a lot of settling with equanimity but he but if every time you see fault of your husband file too wash it off that is all I used to become angry before Gnan, but now after Gnan, I don't get angry with him. You see, now he is helpful for you on moksha because your your moh and his, when when you fight with each other, that means moh is breaking. You see, next one. Seven years ago, I was very depressed, but I got a big book of Dada. and so after reading i i had some dwesh for dada after they receiving this gnan i see negative and then i say that why am i seeing negative i even in the shibir i have seen negativity i want to become free from it please if you know against one negative show him four different positives you see the more you see positive the negative will automatically leave after taking this gnan in the office everybody is doing very good have treating me very well at the office and then rasila parman jay sachidanand mukta patel I have seen mistakes of uh, faults of people in the home. I have seen faults of whoever I have met in life. I want to open now uh, openly declare that in front of you. Very good. I want to be the self only. Good. Next one, Nita Solanki, Ahmedabad. Hasmo <laughs> Patel, Bajur. Dada has opened up the shop for bliss, and I have opened the shop of pain. Initially, I keep on giving pain. I, I hurt mother. Then I was willful. In a fa- joint family. and you know when father passed away my husband's father i had to do my share of whatever need to do what is it bharti manhar so
So I said negative things about my father-in-law who had passed away. And uh, there's a lot of negativity that is there. Are you doing Pratikraman? Yes, I'm doing Pratikraman. But I felt like I have to open it up completely. Right now, everybody has taken none in the family. And so then we came to the father-in-law's. I could not tell anything because of the constraints in my husband's family. I have been bossing other people. I've done a lot. I've done all kinds of mistakes that I... But I felt like I will have to tell the Gnani, so now I'm telling you. Now, please make sure decision that you will not doing again. I want to become free from the Sri Prakruti as Niruma became free from her Sri Prakruti, the female Prakruti. I could see the Viratna and the slander and the negativity of the Gnani Purush in Samaika. Then, then I in Samaika I enter into suffering. I wanted to come out of the suffering and then I said that I cannot uh, be negative to the Prakriti. You know, I I was so, I was really putting down the, the file one so much. Then, then Niruma spoke inside and you see, because then Niruma, Niruma says that whatever sin you will incur, you know, I will take over your sin. But you see, then continue to see in the evening Samaik, I continue to blame myself for then Niruma says that whatever you mistakes you do, I will, I I will you know I will give you my merit karma. So I started saying, the entire samayik happened where Niruma was there for me, helping me. And said so Niruma has got infinite energy, so therefore I did the whole samayik. Therefore, in the entire samayik, I saw all the viradnas that have happened, all the slander, the negativities of the gnani. You know, now that you are in Aradhna, in worship of the Gnani, that means uh, the Viradhna, the negativity is all gone, are all washed off. Is Next one, Rasila Parmar. I have hurt my father-in-law and my mother-in-law a lot because I wanted to have the inheritance. They are not coming here, so the, how? what should I do? You should do it. Now to do the serv their service with good heart because I was really fighting for my inheritance or my share. You see, you see, you know, they are not living with me, but whenever you uh, meet them, show love to them and, and it will all wash off. Next one, Chandrika Patel, Rasila Patel. I have made all kinds of mistakes because of money and I have made my husband fight with his brothers, with his wives. And then, so I have created a lot of difficulties in the joint family because of issues of money and because of these kashais. And I am now very repentant. I am extremely repentant for everything that has happened. Are they here? And also in business, we have fought with each other in the family. And we also have mixed milk with water and served people, you see, make money out of it. And so, is that all left? Yes, after this gnana, we have stopped all that cheating, but, but I do have done Pratikraman. But, uh, but now, uh, when I, then when I do Samaik, it does clear off even more. Are you hurting file two? Yes, not occasionally I do hurt him, but not much. But now with understanding, I do not hurt him as much. I want to become free from every mistake. Call him. Go ahead and call your husband. Just call him. How will you call him? How do you address him? Chagan Bhai, you know, because the Savrashtra women do not call their husbands by their name. They just say, he, he. And then the next lady... Bakariya. It has been eight years since I asked a question to Niruma. My, my husband does not bother me. But, but,
and he came here but he, for the last two parents my son does not come and my son is stealing money from me etc and he is not coming to to coming to this parent so what should i do now i need to take care of my own soul only i don't need to take care of my son who is who is not good he is not behaving properly stealing money and not not on the right path but at the same time i also feel pain because of the son i i ever since i met niruma i come to satsang i come to the sunday also i look at all your cassettes etc i i have a lot of wealth i only have the pain of my son only what should i do why don't you meet an aptaputri and they will tell you what to do how to do the pratikraman and how to really become free from this and so and no don't uh, don't say anything openly too much now just kind of be quiet a little bit you see now just concentrate on your own moksha internally and silently and so now this is the other couple here have you finished all hurting each other yes now you are now now you know you are partners in moksha but you see with all the mistakes that i have done all of this you know all the mixing of the milk with water it bothers me a lot that i do not want to hurt anyone through this mind speech and body and i and you know i i also want to become free from sexuality with the whole world please grant me the energies to become free from sexual problems also next one <clears throat> I have uh, I have you know I have seen your sexual mistakes the Deepak bhai you are the one you have freed me from sexuality and you are freeing people from sexuality but I see your own mistakes of sexuality so this is the viradna I do not want anything out of it I don't know now keep it separate you see he has seen false sexual faults of Deepak bhai and no do not see those you know And you see you are the one who is freeing people from sexuality why should i be seeing your sexual faults she says if it rises just keep on washing and do pratikraman only you know say that uh, you see whether it is deepak bhai or niruma it's not very sure but it doesn't really matter this problem is that she is doing the alochana pratikraman and the pratyakhyan you see this is uh, happened in the past only so i don't want to and he says i see mistakes of dimple by you and niruma i want to really i have seen mistakes uh, sexual mistakes of all three of you next one net chandrika patel and i want to see the i saw i find that the biggest knot is of pride only in samaik uh, there is a more than the gross there is a, i saw a lot at the sat level as especially i am deeply hungry for pride and then i took a lot of garva ras this is the sense that i am superior and i am doing it and i am stick and samayik is the only way out or what else no five, four level and five steps are the critical things five agna double a double b the whatever works clear it all out <coughs> next one I have done insol. I've been insolent to the gnani. Please forgive me. Next one. Uh, especially by by being watching CD and being in your satsang, I get the answers. But with reference to sexuality, I have a my biggest problem is sexuality, and it is the biggest. then read the books of brahmacharya daily and then every day half an hour do the pratikram and then and do the samayik and show him do the four steps find out where there is no pleasure in sex and then in how brahmacharya is helpful to you and wherever you have had made the errors do the pratikraman and pratyakyan every day this is the way you will become free from it you see do you understand <clears throat> 
Yes, he says, I understand. Next one. I I have taken, I have begged a lot of pain. I have imagined a lot of pain. I have magnified a lot of pain. And I have taken on a lot. Now, now that you know that, now keep it separate. You know, see the nimit is flawless and, and resolve never to do it. Manga says, my own people in the family have said negatively, talked negatively about Dada and I am very openly repentant for it, you see. And so the mistakes are of money when only, you see. So now we are washing it all, please. I have also felt like killing myself at certain times and fought about, tell, told them, my people, family, that I would commit suicide and threaten them like this and I... I am asking for the energies to be forgiven in the presence of Dada, Niruma and yourself. By that, please, please make sure. Niruma, Dada, grant me the energy. And then I do Pratikraman and get out of it. Barobar. Deepak Bhai says that's correct. Barobar means that is correct. That is correct. Next one. <clears throat> I want to do file 2 and then and then Yash and Prath. Yash and Prath. There is my, I found out that I have been deeply attached to them and then because of deep attachment I have been de deeply aversive to them also and I I have the lot of this is my two file two my and then Yash and Parth two sons and you can make sure that you will never do it ever again that you are not going to hurt them even in, in the food matters call them and uh, Yash and Parth, please come here. So one of them must be file two and one must be the sun. Okay, next one. <clears throat> and then Manchuben Bilwada. Jai Sachidanan. Yesterday when you did the Samaik of sexuality, I was able to see the mistakes of file... And then I had kicked my file too a lot because of sexuality before Gnanvidi and I in my conduct also has been negative towards my file too. So call him and just finish off the Pratikramans openly. And so here are the open Pratikramans happening now between the different human beings. People singing Dada Bhagwan Nasim Jai Jai Karho. Jai Satsidana. I had... Now I can understand my own moha and then extreme rag. I can see the... And also my desire to be controlling them. So, so just try to improve from where it has been spoiled and remain aware and awakened. You see, remain aware and awakened. There are. I have two brothers uh, who of my husband and two and their wives also. So call. I want to call the entire family. The Taruna Ben and. Ami Ben and Dharvendra Bhai, I want to call all of them. So, she is going to call the extended family, brothers of her husband and their wives too. Okay, there are a lot of questions. So, there is Pati Patni, Mabab Chokra, I have hurt my children, I have hurt a parent, the wives, her, her wife has hurt the husband, the husband has hurt the wife. And so, we also, so let us finish it. There are a lot of questions and also we need to take some time for the Samaik too. So, let us finish all these open pratikramans now and go into the QA session because just go on ahead and just do whatever you need to do openly. Uh, 
Uh, these are especially sticky files. We are going to do a samayik with the chikni file, the sticky file with rag, dvesh, uh, bhav, negative feelings, tiraskar, scorn, you see. Right now, let us now do the samayik only, you see. Ask, are they here? So there are a few remaining people who are coming, so let them finish it. And so, so more people coming, they are singing Dada Bhagwan, they are doing the uh, open, sa open pr pratikraman at the feet of these people, but this today's Samaik is going to be on sticky files and with any kind of kashais that has happened in the entire life with the sticky file, namely the companion or the wife or the husband or the, or the other sticky files in the family, you see. Uh, and so, He is Dada Bhagwan Asim Jejikar who is being sung. So this is the last few people. Dada Bhagwan Asim Jejikar Dada Bhagwan Jai Sachidana. Do you want to say anything? Jai Sachidana, she says. This is my file. Amit Ben is my file too. And for the past six, eight, one months, we come have come here to live in ATPL. But when she was pregnant, when she was pregnant, I hurt her a lot. And even after taking naan, I have drunk alcohol and I have, I'm so sorry. I wanted to get rid of the alcohol and I wanted to come to IATPL only. I have, uh, I have hurt my sister-in-laws also a lot. I have hurt all of these people all my life. Every day I have hurt them because of my problem with the alcohol. And when I see you, I feel so, I feel, see a God only. And I see that this is my God. I see, I want to see God in my file too only. I am in, always in all kinds of turmoil inside. I have made them cry so much, I have made them suffer so much that I want to be forgiven now. And I, if they don't forgive me, then when will I become free from it? Just go ahead and ask for the forgiveness today. Everybody has different prakrutis, you see. And if, you, if your car is going very slow, then you know it will take that much longer to, but you see, you're all going to go. So, she has got such excellent qualities, she has suffered all of this without really attacking me or coming back to me. Now, so just make the nishchai that you do not want to hurt anyone at all. So now this couple, uh, all right. Jai Sachidan. And so the father in front of the little boy whom he has beaten and abused, uh, and the young mother in front of her husband who has been extremely abusive to her, uh, all asking for Pratikraman. There are, we have a lot of questions, you see. Yes, live with love only, you see. Prem Thirejo, live with love only. Jai Sachidana. Huh? Everything, everything is cleared out inside, okay? Very good. Now, let us talk about Pratikraman Samai today now, all right? You can do your uh, samayik in each other. You said you can, in, you know, any pain that has been given to the people in the sticky file in the home, let us look at it. Yes, just go ahead. Some more people want to do the open alochna. Give them microphone to both of them here. They are coming. To, okay, so now this again. Older couple, the older lady, a very old lady. And the older gentleman now in front of her. This is an amazing scene. 
and now he goes flat. Jai Sachidan. Now give them a microphone. I have, after coming here, I have a lot of peace. I had given her a lot of pain in Godra. I, we took Nan from Niruma, but now we have a lot of peace. Yes, you will be able to live in peace now. Do you want to say anything to the lady? Yes, yes. I have had a lot of pain. I have been in continuous pain all my life, but now all of that pain is gone now. Hey, Dada, I'm surrendering everything to you. Take me to moksha. That is the answer. You know, if you had not, did not have this pain in life, you would have never asked for moksha, you see. I also have my daughters here, I want to ask for their forgiveness. And so she is calling her daughters now or the daughter-in-law, I don't know. Her, phys her uh, financial situation is very bad, what should I do? You see? It is w the pain that has come to me is what I had given to others in the past life and it has come back. Yes. Because he has also hurt. You see, he has not done it, but I have... There is the mother going to these two daughters, you see. And because of him, because of my moh of him, I have hurt others. Let us now... To uh, set the understanding of our own samai, wherever we have, where because of our own moha, the, because of our pride, because of our willfulness, where we have hurt others because of our own kashais, this is where rag, dvesh, abhav, tiraskar, apeksha, expectations are not fulfilled, scornfulness, negativity, find out all of these incidents and what all in countless previous lifetimes, you see, in the, all those ragdveshis of previous life are there, then, you know, you become each other's husband, wife, mother-in-law, sister-in-law, brother, daughter, etc. And you come together, you finish the accounts and then you, uh, then you go, they go away from each other and life after life, this is what we have done. You miss, you get out of this crowd and uh, you do the same thing again, again you do ragdvesh, Moha, illusory attachment, abhav is the dislike and tiraskar is the scornfulness. So the other person is only a nemet. My own kashais are the reason why these are coming back to me again, you see. You know, you know, everybody is just finished emptying, but you see, they clash with each other, but you see, but you see, then you bind karma for the next life and then go into the next life. And this is how we are going. What does he want to say? Somebody wants to say something. Because of all of this, because we want to also take forgiveness from all the Mahatma brothers and sisters here also. You know, we have done some service and let me give us the energy to do some seva. Next one. Today we will do the Samaik where the biggest thing is because of money, because of sex, ragdesh happens, because of money, ragdesh happens, and because of spirituality, uh, spiritual colleagues, ragdesh arises. And now the fourth category is life after life, these sticky files are accounts from previous lives only, and that is why they are sticky right now, and that is why they are our husband, wives, children, etc. And we have done, we have done these mistakes because of moha, because not knowing who I am, I, the other person is not at fault at all. But, you know, we have attacked him, we have hurt him or the her. And so let us in, close your eyes and when you close your eyes, uh, recall all of the circumstances with the mother, with the father, with the grandmother, with the grandfather, with the aunt, with the uncle, with the, with the cousin, but more importantly, the wife and the husband, the daughter, the son-in-law, you see, or when the father-in-law, the mother-in-law, wherever all of these problems have arisen, you know, pick it up, be extremely dependent, be repentant about it, 
and and then wash it off this is uh, the pratikraman is the only spiritual weapon that will make you free from this and as you become free from files you will be getting the green signals to move forward to the into the shelter of lord simandar it is because of these files that you are stuck here you see in your see you know don't have the whole world as the file there are only two or five sticky files only it was because of the sticky files your moksha has been blocked and therefore you see the more there is the more you, and the more you clash with each other you start seeing more faults and then you have the expectations and then you accuse and you expect and you accuse and then there is a bow there is dislike and repulsion and then there is the tortured and there is the scorn and the contempt etc so let us find out and then also make an extreme decision and that i do not want to hurt anyone i do not want to see their faults at all and i do not want to come in any kind of clash with any one of them i want to make the adjustments myself from inside because i want to become free from them i want to clear off from their accounts so as you as we become free from our own rag dvesh uh, in discharge then then you will be then you know we are, i'll be able to see only my own rag dvesh and moh and illusory attachment and as i finish on my own rag dvesh and moh illusory attachment then i will become free from it so let us enter into the samayak of very deep the sticky file accounts of rag dvesh you see let us do the vidhi now he dada bhagwan the absolute self within me he shri simandar swami prabhu o lord at mahavide the perfect lord there with the exact applied awareness of the self shuddh upyog in the entire life with whoever has met me i whatever rag dvesh has happened vishay kashai sexuality and kashai abhav tiraskar repulsion and scorn any kind of fault that has happened and let me see all of those mistakes of mine let me see them and and to and, and in front of the the shuddhatma bhagwan of the other person let me do the pratikraman and pratyakyan and in with every file let me let me win the file with knowledge and gnan let me do such a samayik my lord I, i surrender this mind speech and body all illusions associated with my name bhav karma charge karma dravya karma subtle discharge karma no karma gross discharge karma he dada bhagwan the absolute self within me you are the manifest lord god absolute self within me and you and it is at your feet at your divine faith that i am surrendering all of these i am surrendering them all to you atma chu shuddhatma 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 chu 
Should that match you? Should that match you? At match you? Should that 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 match you? Jai Sachidanan. Jai Sachidan. Jai Sachidan. Go deep and do a beautiful samaik. Don't move from here. Yes, what all the mistakes of the entire life, remember them, recall them and clear them. And Pratyakhyan means I will never do them again. It says, in any matters of life, in the worldly interactions, you see, no matter what, I want to become free from it because I want to go to moksha only. I want to go to moksha only. Jai Satchitana. Sachidanand everyone, Mahatmas, I, my highest namaskars and at this moment I ask for forgiveness for any errors that may have happened through the tone of these words or through this speech or through any actions in the process of uh, doing these translations. If there is any, been any negativity created, please forgive Shuddha for it. I touch your feet with a lot of love and Jai Sachidanand, Jai Sachidanand.